Hello folks, welcome to the channel. This is DoorDash Sucks here on YouTube and uh, it's a Monday uh, night um, around 5.30 or so. It's uh, kind of slow in my market on a Monday, Tuesday, uh, but I do some different things in the morning time so I have to take the night shift. And I've been predominantly working basically six to seven days a week try to make up for the losses, you know, you got to do what you got to do, right, but um, anyways, I noticed with uh, Uber Eats, when I use them, I only use Uber Eats as a secondary app, and I very, I use them very sparingly, but I noticed when I, when I put it on, you know, I, I may get a call immediately, like a delivery immediately, and, you know, it's, some of these are really asinine, they're like, <laughs> 23 miles uh, or 24 miles for $23, right? And like what that turns out to be is 50 cents a mile, right? And it's even less than that because look at the gas prices, right? And then they've given you like after you don't take what they want you to take, then they put you in punishment mode. Now, none of us can really prove that, but I... I've kept my app on as much as four to five hours in a row and not got one, one call coming through. And it's pretty odd, right? But then you go to shut it off and turn it back on 15 minutes later after something like that. And then miraculously, oh, the calls start coming in. See, they don't like when you don't take the ones that they want you to take. But so, you know, are we independent contractors or are we employees? Now, that's leading into a video that I recorded last night that I'm going to post up um, later, either later tonight or tomorrow, and uh, hopefully you guys will watch that because it's really important. It has, you know, a lot of important information in there that some of you may not know, some of you may not want to know, <laughs> and uh, I just had to do it, folks because this is what this channel is about, exposing all the fraud and the things that are going on behind the scenes that people don't know about. It's not that people are ignorant, it's just they have not researched certain things, so they're not going to know about it. So at least you'll know about what's actually going on. Uh, and, um, you know, anyway, so there's a video coming, and uh, it's kind of slow in my area tonight, but... Um, never take the, uh, never take the, never take folks the more miles than money. Always take more, more money than miles. And, uh, boy, the gas prices are just outrageous. Uh, it's gone over five bucks a gallon around where I live, except there's some few pockets that you can still get it for like four eighty nine, four seventy nine. But that's about it. All of the uh, regular prices have been completely <laughs> put up. And a lot of these gas comp uh, gas stations are taking advantage too because they're raising it higher than they need to raise it because they buy it in like loads of gallons, right? When a truck comes to deliver that gas, you know, it, it might ha it might drop 20,000 gallons or 10,000, no, 10,000 gallons in a 10,000 gallon tank, right? Um, and so it's based on the load, right? And they may be buying the gas for, say, $3.25 or something, right? And if they just put it to three fifty, they, you know, they're okay, right? But no, what they do is they're like, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna bring it up to the national average to where it is, and that 470, 479, 489, four, five bucks, right? And I get it to a point because sometimes these companies they don't make a whole lot of money, but everyone's jumping in on the bandwagon, and then you know the the prices are being raised at the um, the pickup point too, like wherever they go to pick up the loads of gas, and then it gets turned on to the consumer. It's all it's all a trickle, it's called trickle-down economics, folks. <laughs> and we're the little peons, the little ones that uh, get screwed the worst, right? And so that's why this, this video I'm going to put out later or tomorrow, you're going to want to listen to and watch. It's kind of long, about 40 minutes, but 
it's worth to listen to, folks. I took the time to, you know, do it. So, And I have a couple other videos going to come out. One on Taco Bell. I call it Taco Hell. And I can't remember what the other one is, but, um, you know, I, it's hard for me to upload these videos every single day, you know. Again, I don't make any money on this channel. I don't take any, you know, donations or nothing. I'm doing it all for free. So you have to bear with me, folks. Uh, but I love all of you guys and gals out there. And please keep commenting on the videos because you make a difference in the community. Because when someone comes to the videos and they read the comments, your comments really help. And some of you that I find really interesting, I pin the comments to some of these videos. You might notice that you got pinned to the video because you may have taken the time to really do a detailed comment. So I really love that. And then, you know, I'll give you the credit on there and by pinning it. So anyways, that's about all I have for you for uh, this Monday. And um, thank you so much for listening to today, you know, tonight's video. And um, I'll catch you guys and gals on the next one. Take care.